Hi students welcome back to our class today we are going to discuss about tangents and angles in a circle the angles between the radii through two points and the angle between the tangents at these points are supplementary here x is the angle between the radii and y is the angle between the tangents these two angles are supplementary which means angle x plus angle y which is equal to 180 degree the sum of angles equal to 180 degree for example here the angle between the radii is 120 degree and angle between the tangent is 60 degree so 120 plus 60 which is equal to 180 Let's do some exercise questions related to this on page number 166. The picture shows the tangents at two points on a circle and the radii through the points of contact. Question number 1 prove that the tangents have it, the same length. Question number 2 prove that the line joining the center and the point where the tangents meet bisects the angle between the radii. third one prove that this line is the perpendicular bisector of the chord joining the points of contact okay let's prove one by one are you ready children okay here o is the center of the circle oa and ob are the radii of the circle from a and b we drawn two tangents and it meet at a point p first we have to join op to prove pa equal to pb as we all know that angle between tangent and radii is 90 degree so angle a equal to 90 angle b equal to 90 considering the right triangle triangle poa by using pythagoras theorem we can write pa equal to root of op square minus oa square hypotenuse square minus base square pa equal to root of op square minus oa square which is equal to root of op square minus ob square replace ob instead of oa so p square minus ob square because oa and ob are equal they are the radii of the circle so which is equal to op square minus ob square equal to pb square so which is equal to root of pb square root of pb square equal to pb this shows that pa equal to pb this shows that pa equal to pb hence the proof in the second question we have to prove that the line joining the center and the point where the tangents meet bisects the angle between the radii which means op bisects angle o so we enough to prove that these two angles are equal okay for that first we have to consider triangle apo and triangle bpo here op equal to op common side okay op equal to op common side then oa equal to ob are the radii of the circle oa equal to ob pa equal to pb we already proved in sub question number 1 pa equal to pb we already proved in sub question number 1 therefore triangle apo equal to triangle bpo which means that 
these two triangles are equal triangles these two triangles are equal triangles all the three sides of both triangles are equal okay by cpct rule that means corresponding parts of a congruent triangle we can write angle aop equal to angle pop hence the proof this shows that this line bisects the angle o in the third question we have to prove that the line op is the perpendicular bisector of the chord joining the points of contact which means we have to prove that q is the midpoint of ab so we enough to show that aq equal to bq so considering the triangles triangle aoq and triangle boq oq equal to oq the common side oq equal to oq common side oa equal to ob radii of the circle radii angle aoq equal to angle boq that we have already proved in question number 2 sub question number 2 this shows that these two triangles are which triangles triangle aoq and triangle boq are equal triangles okay are equal triangles so by cpct rule we can write aq equal to bq aq equal to bq okay hence the proof